we'll get answers to help us visualize the full 3D geometry by revolving the 2D geometry about the axis. So to do that, first go to the project page by clicking on this yellow icon here. And if you're working in version 14.0, you need to turn on the beta options. So select Tools, Options, Appearance, scroll down, and turn on beta options. In a later version, you won't be uh, needing to do this. Okay, once you've turned on the beta options, you can go back to the uh, mechanical window. And what you need to do is add a symmetry object. So highlight model in the tree and click symmetry. And that adds a symmetry object under model. And under details of symmetry, go to type and from Cartesian, change it to 2D axis symmetric. And so what ANSYS will do is take this 2D section and revolve it um, in 10 degree increments, um, a total of, uh, I guess, 36 times. Um, and that'll basically cover the entire circle, circumference. So once I've done that, if I go and take a look at, say, any of my results, uh, for instance, the normal stress, I see that it's showing me the full um, 3D geometry. And I can get a more suitable view by clicking on this ball here that gives me the isometric view. I might want to turn off the undeformed wireframe in this view. Okay, and the max is just showing one point, but since, you know, it's basically this whole is one section revolved around um, the axis, you know, the max is really um, a circle around. So I can turn off the max because that's misleading. And note that there is no variation in the circumferential direction because the way ANSYS has generated this is to is by revolving the 2D geometry about the axis and to see the 2D geometry that um, we have, just highlight geometry in the tree. And so that's all you have and this is just a visualization, the normal stress. You can also animate this view by clicking on going to the graph window and clicking on play. And all that is doing is interpolating between the final configuration and the initial undeformed configuration. And you can save this uh, video to a file by um, using this icon here that says export video file and you can save it in AVI format. And to get back the 2D views on your results, you will have to go back to the symmetry object and delete it, which I won't do here. So I'll go back, show my normal stress, um, and I'll say File, Save Project. 